Sunday, which was Dr. Jolie. <laughs> and I said, do you know, am I okay? I'm hitting the big emergency. Uh, do you know how to get in there? Is everything okay? And she says, when will you be there? I said, I don't know. I'll be there in about 20, 25 minutes. I'll meet you there. I said, no, no. I'm not calling you to meet you there, to meet us there. Just tell me how to get there. I'm going to go. Because, you know, when you get the emergency, you could sit there for six, seven hours. She says, I'll be there. I'm leaving now. And this is one of the bees that met us in the emergency. You all heard me talk about the bees. So thank you, Dr. Jolie. And thank you to all the bees. Killer, killer bee, Elaine. Right? There's the Judy bee, okay. There's the Janus bee, there's the Sandy bee. I'm sorry, I'm not going to start naming. Um, but, but my son said, don't name the bees. But all these girls, this is probably our last night having, because tomorrow night is finished. I, I, I want again, I could not have gotten through this without their help. Every morning and all through the day, calling and taking Janice, because I don't know if I explained this to you, but my wife wasn't able to sit and watch TV. She wasn't able to read a book, and she needed to be occupied. She needed to be busy. She couldn't go anymore to Sanctuary, which turned her whole, her whole life upside down. And all she wanted to know was, who's coming, who's coming, who's coming, and what are we going to do? And these bees came through and kept her company. And, and again, as I said in my... In, in the funeral, I want to thank you, I want to thank you, I want to thank you. Thank you for coming. Anytime you hear a tambourine, I want you to think of Janice. Yeah, we will. Yes, we will. Okay, we're going to...